Hi, I'm Kat, and it is finally episode six time, which is the one that I've seen people freaking out over. So, what will happen? I think Billy and Daisy are hooking up in this one. What does it say? The band records their album Aurora. Wow, the entire album in one episode. The heart of which is the always complicated but typically fruitful collaboration, collaboration between Billy and Daisy. As their working relationship intensifies, their personal relationship threatens to completely implode, causing Daisy to make an impulsive decision. Meanwhile, Camilla harbors a secret of her own. I did also see that there's the possibility of Camilla and Eddie. So interesting. Um, Daisy's impulsive decision, it's either hooking up with Billy or, I mean, I can see that she's at a party by the pool in the thumbnail. So this could be her almost overdosing or maybe she could be running off to Italy to go marry a prince. Let's find out. Wait, what are you saying? Bullshit. No, I swear, I swear on my life. <laughs> I love everyone's faces and their reaction. It was working. <laughs> Did Tobias even notice them? It needs to sound swampy. Swampy? You know what I mean? It needs to sound swampier. Swampy? Uh, hey, was that so hard? <laughs> Bill's a Billy. Oh, we didn't get Teddy playing on it. All by myself. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, that's an intense lyric. <laughs> they just forget that they. It's not what you think, that. man. Come here, tira la foto. Ah. Tú la tomaste. Some of us don't mm -hmm. speak Spanish. Please put the subtitles. Let's fucking go back and if it sure. says they're speaking Spanish, I'm gonna hit someone. There it is. Thank you. Stammering in Spanish. Que la so it's not Eddie. What do you look like? It's gonna be like this random guy. Know. I'm just painting. Anyway, how are you and Graham? Wait, what? <laughs> Intense. <laughs> Literally the word I can use. Daisy, you're obviously the Billy. I'm oh, sorry, you didn't see coded. This is wrong. This is. It was different in my head. Yeah, it's not coded. Where it's just going? Like, I'm just hitting a low. She was gonna do it, not in front of him. What are they gonna do, skinny dip? You make everything better. Mm. I still need to figure out the rest of that. Okay. Okay. He made one good decision. Is he still there? But he doesn't mind if people think they does. Mm. He said it's. Yeah, that's gonna hurt Daisy. Oh, is this the party where she's gonna walk on glass? It's the really expensive um, dress thing. Yeah, there it is. I wrote something for you. Is this the version of Impossible Woman? Let it out. Oh, is this kind of good? He like pushes her until she gets it. I just need you to feel what I mean, what are you afraid of? It's not her words, anyway. Yeah. Tell me if I'm fucking crazy. I still need a drink left towards my heart. And he's in the room. See, I ship it in a messy way, but then I love Camilla. Photo shoot yourself at home in the, in the middle of the desert. It's so windy. Oh, I feel so bad for them. Oh, much, isn't it? <laughs> so big again. But where's her sister? Oh my gosh, you're so good. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> too fucking hard and I'm too fucking good to be forever known as the girlfriend of the sex. Mm-hmm. Do you understand that? Not what they end up with in the final product, anyway. <laughs> and we 
about to get regret me. Oh, there is a car in front of you and you're not looking. Okay. She looks nice. Is this Eddie coming up in the background? Okay, the person walking wasn't Eddie, but that is Eddie. I mean, why the fuck not, right? Well, he's back. Asshole. <laughs> Juicy over everyone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, how does it feel? Are we just skipping it? Did she do anything with Eddie? I think I just needed one of my own. Well. Hey man. Oh, and he's running away. So something happened. But what? It's a great song, but I still would have liked the lyric when you think of rock and roll. I, when you think of me, I hope everyone's rock and roll. Right, man, it's it's good. <laughs> Tobias? You too? Look, man. Are they gonna I'm not trying to cause any problems. problems. I don't really um, know. Um, do whatever the fuck you want. <laughs> Stayed around to uh, see what happened. <laughs> I don't think we did anything, actually. <laughs> I wanna read it. <laughs> it's just spelt wrong. We used to fight like that. So it doesn't look like they're fighting in the picture. Know everything, but, uh, they're very cool. Nobody's lived here since Wednesday. She in Italy? Barfoot! And how long are you planning to stay in Greece, Miss Jones? Greece! Interesting. Honestly, I would have picked Greece over Italy as well. All of the drama is happening and I'm just so... Like... I was the word focused on like... All the the little things that are happening, and we got an actual Daisy and Billy kiss. Will there be more? Notes. Everyone is so expressive with their faces. They're all so good. Like it'll cut to like anyone, and you could just see what they're thinking, and it's so good. And Teddy was playing a little bit on the album with the I don't no remember the name of it the the thing. But that's cute. When we when we saw the lyrics for Please, I was like, that's intense. And then Camilla saw it and then later she called it intense as well. Uh, when Camilla was speaking Spanish with the guy in the dark room, uh, why was Prime not automatically putting subtitles up for that? I had to go and find the subtitles myself. Because I don't watch I don't watch normally with subtitles on because I will spend the entire time reading the subtitles instead of actually watching the show it's too much happening and then yeah I just have who is this guy in the dark room did, did he have a name I don't know what is, is he going to be important or is he was he just there for a moment so Camilla could have this epiphany and I just have Camilla baby like I love like I love the drama and intensity of Billy and Daisy being together but I don't want Camilla to get her in the meantime and I just want everyone to be happy together. Daisies. I didn't like myself when I was little, so I became someone else. Oof. Wow. I was actually really expecting Billy to walk into her hotel room. But then he left. He made one good decision. Because I, I was just kind of expecting them to go like full force into it with everyone's reactions. Then we had the walking on glass party. So that was another like book goodness thing. But then it was like... 30 seconds like it wasn't a lot of the party at all and I feel like the party was focused more on in the books and I feel like Simone might have been there as well we got no Simone this episode but yeah we had Daisy going full force into her addiction then we had Billy pushing Daisy to get the vocals on the song so we're getting like everything from the books well most of the stuff from the books is just in kind of in different places so instead of the being the push happening and then the hug happening, we had a hug last episode, and then we had the push happening, and then they went out, and then the kiss happened in in the parking lot, like where anyone could see them at any moment. 
So I'm wondering if someone did see them. Where was Jonah during all of this? And then he was in the room. I like love the intensity stuff where they like put the singer and the person like they're singing to in the same room. That also happened in Paradise City, which is the like the TV spin-off of American Satan. And it was Bella Thorne and Andy, I, f I forget his last name, like in the same room, just really intense. Then we had the iconic photo shoot, which I do kind of miss, like the, the book version of the photo shoot, but this photo shoot was also very aesthetically pleasing and more extra. Then the band with Julia is so cute. Julia has grown up so much, so quickly. So I guess Julia is like our person showing the passage of time because everyone else looks the same. They were all so cute. Which I guess, yeah, it's pretty much like me and my friends with our other friends' kids. And then we had a little bit of Daisy with Julia. And... Julia went for her hair, which is such a toddler thing to do. Karen and Graham were having a bit of a moment and Karen- Okay, Karen. Yes, Karen doesn't want to be known as the girlfriend in the band, which makes complete sense. And then she also, again, she keeps telling Graham exactly what she thinks and what she wants. And he's still gonna get mad at her. And then I have poor Camilla. I feel so bad for Camilla through all of this, but I also need to know what happened between her and Eddie. Like I thought we were getting the truth in these flashback parts. So why didn't we see it? Are we gonna see it later? We still got the regret me set up even though it was different to in the books. She hit someone with her car. And regret me is still a bop, but I still miss the iconic lyric of when you think of me I hope it ruins rock and roll like I thought we were at least gonna get that like said in the show or just in there somewhere because it is so iconic how could they not put it in there why didn't they put it in there anyone from the show is somehow watching this please explain and again Camilla back to Camilla uh, Billy is getting a taste of his own medicine he was sitting there like with dinner and Camilla wasn't around. Yeah, how does that feel? Then the album cover, Camilla took the picture um, and she just, again, is trusting Billy too much and is putting too much faith in him. She deserves better. I highly, like, like if she had ended up with Eddie, I highly doubt Eddie would have ever cheated on her. Then right at the end there, Daisy takes off to Europe, but she goes to Greece, not Italy. And am I forgetting it in the book where maybe she goes to Greece first and then Italy? Or maybe she meets the Italian prince in Greece? But I feel like she just went to Italy. She gets a haircut, which I don't think she's going to get her haircut because I haven't seen any pictures of her with the shorter hair. Overall, I too would choose Greece over Italy just because I want to live my best Mamma Mia life. But I am just really interested if she'll come back with an Italian or a Greek prince. It was a really good episode. I'm loving the drama happening. I'm not a fan of the fact that we're still in the dark on some things. Especially with Camilla. We shouldn't be in the dark. We're not the interviewer. We should be seeing everything. I just want to know. Comment down below what your favorite part of episode six was. And if you just want to let me know you were here, leave me a musical emoji down below as always. Please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel to see the rest of my Daisy Jones videos and my Shadow and Bone videos coming soon. And stick around a little longer for some other videos you might like. 